So that is the challenge. That's a big challenge. That's a big, big challenge. Now, if you don't have pets, you might find this quite hard to believe, but the love for my cats, B and Bruce, Bruce being the big tall one, B being the smaller ginger one, both twins, but the love I have for them is insane. It's parallel to my kids, I'm telling you now. But something happened this morning that made me think, are my cats a bit narcissistic? Can I get a McPlant burger meal, please? Bruce made me a little bit suspicious when he led me to his treats when I thought he wanted a cuddle this morning. And he started to make me think about something I've been wrestling with lately, and that's whether I'm a bit of a narcissist. <laughs> grand idea to film a few scenes while I shot down in the car to grab a little bit of a Friday night takeaway treat for me and Vicky. I didn't go to plan. So on this narcissistic point, I'd actually thought about putting stories a little bit less about me and more about other people. Now, as it happens, at the same time, we'd also been talking, me and my wife, about yeah, my videos, and she don't, she, she's a very, very private person. So the conflict here is that we agreed, I'm not going to put the kids in the videos anymore, and I'm not going to film in the house apart from the office, because she just doesn't like it. So that's fine. So I'm going to switch tactics. So here I am. But I wanted to say last night, I have three problems. This is the build-up. Are you ready? The first is my cat a narcissist. Two, am I a narcissist? And three... The important thing, I want to tell more stories and do films without just me. I want to build characters into these channels and I was hoping to do that with my friends and family. is my worry when I envisage this channel and I mean this I wanted to do I wanted to use my creative outlet which is taking photos uh, making films and that is massively behind the lens so I really hope it doesn't come across but it isn't something I, I like I'm naturally outgoing and all that stuff but long story short I'm battling and grappling with this issue about yeah, is it too self like, I don't know the right word for it but you know am I being too Oh, look at me, <laughs> basically. And that wasn't the plan for this channel, because the long-term plan always was to build a small community to then give back. And that was all around filming you, filming other people in the artistic world. I was really hoping to get some good stories, like from, from like my background of having dyslexia and then finding these arts to sort of bring you out of your own shell. That, that type of thing, and being able to tell someone's story artistically through film is what I was hoping to do. But obviously, it's a little bit harder to get there. So that is the challenge. That's a big challenge. That's a big, big challenge. The, the issue that I found really is 
yeah, I did love, I do love this vlog, I love this, I don't like calling it vlogs, I feel like it downgrades, I love making films that have that concentration on the storytelling, but less so the, the cinematic view, and the only reason for that is because I've not got the time, we don't have the time to do daily vlogs in a cinematic way, really, I try my best to make it as cinematic as possible, but really, in my schedule to do that I'd need to be the cameraman and be the director and be the producer as opposed to being the person in front of the camera so that's the whole trick and that's why I use that sort of home sort of schooling method if you like but, but bringing in characters and trying to tell these stories I really love, love that that's so much fun but yeah that's that's something that's probably going to not happen as much so this is this really is something to mull over before I hope I can build it on that and get out there so that's hard to heart, really, but there we go. <laughs> this is the issue. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Just look at these two. I figured I named the episode Our Cat's Narcissist, so I need to show you as many of my cat pics as I can. <laughs> but if you don't fall in love with these, then, to be honest, I don't want you here. Get away. Because <laughs> they are beautiful. I love them so much. Um, back to my main point today. So this is going back to it. I want to tell stories. I've got to get out. So this is my new mission now for the next couple of weeks. Oh my, I've got a one hour lunch. I'm going to go out. I've got a few ideas in my head. You've got to do it at some point, haven't you? So let's give it a bash, eh? So that's it. That's what's going to happen. So keep an eye out. Happy Wednesday. I'll see you next Monday. See you next week. Boodles. <laughs>